Tonight is the summer of 69. <laughs> Megan is a great musical talent, and I aspire <laughs> to one day be considered musical. Oh, Nick's great. He bought a guitar years ago um, and taught himself to play, more or less. I mean, you had like maybe a few lessons, which was smart. I should do that. It came about organically that I began touring as a humorist and inexplicably playing comedy songs. There's a burning pink furnace in your crotch. If I put my hand in there, it'll melt my watch. A mythology has sort of sprung up around our <laughs> our love. Good evening. God damn, you look amazing. <laughs> oh, hey guys. And it's simply by, by the nature of remaining married. <laughs> We're celebrated. They're like, As holy shit. The greatest shit, these love story ever told. These people have stayed together. <laughs> What's their secret? Our marriage works because we simply like each other. <laughs> We're at fault for thinking people are refined enough to read a title that has a joke in it and get it. Because there's probably a lot of people that somebody said, hey, that lady you like from Will and Grace and some plumber are doing a show. Do you want to get tickets? People would come and be like, the show is filthy, it's so dirty and dirty words. And I'm like, did you read the title? Then there's 6911. That's for when it's an emergency. As it so often is. <laughs> if you like a mouthful of balls, you will love Summer of 69. Get your load. <laughs>